What's up guys, it's Lucifer here with more GTA Online. Today I'll be showing you guys how to do the diamond casino heist. With artwork has the wall content. It could even be gold or cash or even diamonds. We're doing the Bitcoin approach, let's get started. Well, stealing would be the easy part, but escaping is the real challenge here. It's all about timing. We come across our first obstacle and it was a speed breaker and a big one too. But I look around and realize we were on the sidewalk and that's it, no further questions asked. We pass the security without an issue and make our way to the elevator. From all the movies that I've seen, I'm actually kinda worried if there's any jump scare here like a random kid would pop up and just stare at you. If you're doing a staring contest, at least give me a heads up so I can prep my eyes else I'd lose in the very first try. It's always better to know your co-workers or in this case you'll end up like these guys who left two highly trained professionals pass right through their line of sight undetected. We come across our second obstacle and its lack of coordination and we mess up the very first try. We have to swipe both the key cards at the same time for it to open. And finally we're in. Now this next part is probably my favorite cutscene in the entire game and believe me I've seen quite a few. Like this guy is doing his duty opening the safe for us so that we can do a regular inspection of the vault. He doesn't suspect a thing and lets his guard down. And then boom you're looking for this, time to start looting. What knife is this? It's so smooth. I wish my life IRL was this smooth but it's a bumpy ride and I don't know how long it'll take me to reach to the top. I do a bunch of hacking too cause that's essential in the heist for opening doors. Always have two hackers in the group else you'll waste time like we did. The more heist you do, the better intel you get. We got a decent take but if there were two others with us, we'd bleed this place dry. We went back in the same way but leaving out the elevator part because I was too sure this time the creepy kid would appear and would get me. I don't like losing so I'm not taking any risk. We do some stealth takedowns and make our way to the laundry room to get our exit disguise. Well, two random firefighters just show up out of nowhere right after the vault has been hit and nobody bats an eye. It's almost as if they wanted us to loot the place. We make our ways to the getaway vehicles positioned so close we didn't even have to walk. And the only thing left is to lose the wanted level. Hence we give a visit to the lizard people living below us who will do a ritual and get rid of it. It's a long journey now but nobody wants to see that. It always bothered me that they take the entire bag and give us a suitcase worth of money. It's not fair GTA logic. And I pocket a decent 876k for a 30 minute job. This is probably the best money making business in the game. Thank you guys for watching this video. Give a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you are new and I will see you guys next time.